the intersection of uh, fan curves and the system curves define the operating point when the system resistance changes the operating point also changes so you can see in this figure that uh, the system curves which are shown by the dashed lines and the fan curves which are shown by the solid lines and the intersection points of uh, these uh, curves is the operating point uh, at which the fan that will be operated and uh, there you can see there are three points A, B and C. There are two uh, curves uh, of fan curves are shown which the first one is at N1 and the second one is at N2. It shows that uh, at higher RPMs N1 is higher and N2 is lower RPM. So at the lower RPM uh, you can see that pressure is uh, uh, also low and uh, Q which is the volumetric airflow is also low. So at uh, low RPM uh, the as the airflow is decreased the pressure drop in the ducting system is also decreased so we can find um, operating points by using these fan curves and system curves then this diagram shows us different fan laws the first one is that flow is directly proportional to speed as we increase the rpms it will definitely increase the air delivery and they are uh, in the real linear relationship and the second law is uh, is for pressure is directly proportional to the square of rpm or speed and uh, it means that if we increase the rpm by 10% uh, uh, sorry if we reduce the rpm by 10% it will decrease the pressure by 19% and if we increase the rpm by 10% it will increase the pressure by 21% the third law is for power is directly proportional to uh, cube of speed that uh, it means that by reducing the RPM by 10% decreases the power requirement by 27% and uh, an increase in RPM by 10% increases the power requirement by 33% then uh, there are some important points in fan design and selection criteria so fan is selected on the basis of its airflow and uh, outlet pressure and uh, uh, after calculating the pressure drop in the piping and ducting systems these pressure drops should be added to any fixed pressure required by the process so after knowing the required pressure we can select a uh, fan and design uh, can be modified one is backward curved fans are most stable uh, operation also the power required by most backward curved fans will decrease at flow higher than design values uh, forward curve fans are suitable for less uh, because they are less efficient uh, than backward curve fans and power rises continuously with flow so uh, among the other centrifugal fans airfoil designs provide hi the highest efficiency up to 10 percent higher than the backward curve blades but their use is limited to clean dust free air the axial flow fans produce 
lower pressure than centrifugal fans and exhibit a dip in pressure before reaching the peak pressure point. Axial flow fans equipped with adjustable variable pitch blades are also available to meet the varying flow requirements. Uh, then uh, propeller type fans are capable of high flow rates at low pressures. Tube axial fans have uh, medium pressure, high flow capability, and not and are not equipped with guide vanes. Vane axial fans are equipped with inlet or outlet guide vanes and are characterized by high pressure, medium flow rate capabilities. The fan performance uh, can be measured by flow head temperature measurement on the fan side and electrical motor input measurement uh, at the motor side. Uh, the flow fan flow is measured using is uh, by using pitted tube and an uh, manometer combination. So the formula that is used for density calculation of air is uh, is given in the as for equation number one the velocity of air in a duct or pipe can be uh, measured by the second formula the volumetric flow rate uh, is a product of velocity and the cross-sectional area of duct or a pipe there are two uh, efficiencies which are which are linked to fans one is mechanical efficiency the second one is fan static efficiency the formulas uh, for calculating mechanical efficiency or static efficiency are also given by using this these uh, formulas we can uh, evaluate the performance of a fan or uh, uh, we can keep and check on the performance and uh, uh, we can do routine maintenances as well. Thank you.